everybody, it's Becca. I'm here with another layout for you guys. Um, today I am going to make another uh, cutesy type layout using my Cricut. Um, today I used this uh, Me and My Big Ideas 12 by 12 specialty card stock. Um, and it's just got some really fun patterns on it. And I decided that this one uh, will work great with uh, my idea that I had. I also used the Create a Critter cartridge and I did um, a monkey and some vines. And then I also used Elegant Edges. Um, I used this cartridge as well. And so everything was cut uh, using my Cricut Craft Room. And um, we're just gonna, gonna and we're just gonna go ahead and get started. So uh, let's hang out. This was cut at five inches. Um, now the Create a Critter cartridge doesn't have a shadow feature for their fonts or for their phrases, so I just made this shadow by hand just because this paper is so busy that it needed a shadow in order to pop out. So that's gonna go in the corner here, and then I'm gonna pop it up. And then I cut for at uh, six inch or seven inches, sorry, um, from the elegant edges this photo mat here on oblong, and I did a shadow for it, and that's gonna go right here. Now all my images and everything are very plain for this. Uh, there's no inking, no distressing, or anything like that because this paper is so busy that if I started making all this stuff fancy it would just be too much. So these are very plain and this is very um, busy but I, re I really like this paper for the theme that I'm going with. I also made a journaling card. Um, you could use this as a journaling card or another photo. I'm going to use it for journaling. The green paper is three and a quarter by four and a quarter and the pink paper is three by four and that's going to go right here and then I use my We Are Memory Keepers corner chomper to round the corners. Now I cut this at six inches. This is a vine. It's one of the accessory features on the monkey and it's gonna go right here and I'm just gonna mark where it goes and then I'll chop off the extra. And then this monkey from the Creative Crit Critter was cut at five inches and he's gonna hang right here off the vine and I'm going to pop him up and then I cut out a couple extra um, of these vines but I'm not sure I was thinking of putting one down like this I'm not sure if I want to yet but I have a few different ones that I thought maybe I would throw in there just to kind of see maybe put one here or something I haven't decided yet. I'm going to get all this adhered down and then I'm going to add a few finishing touches and then we'll come back. So I'm back with my finished layout and I did not do a whole lot. I just added, um, I layered two flowers here, a paper flower and then uh, more of a dimensional flower. Um, here I put uh, another flower, two flowers and then um, two rhinestones. And then on the bottom here again, I just did a rhinestone and two flowers. And I just stuck with a pink color. Um, just to kind of, it puts a, it gives you a, like a diagonal straight to the pictures. And then you've got the title. So the title's popped up, the monkey's popped up. But then I glued his little hand down to kind of give a little dimension. And I really like how this turned out. So this is my completed layout. And this will fit a 4x6 horizontal photo. And then you could fit a little photo here or journaling. And I'm going to journal here. So thank you guys so much for watching. And have a great day. Bye.